Hi, I'm John. And I'm Dean. You're watching Chimney Cricket TV. Very often do we go to customers or get calls about wind-driven downdrafts, people having smoke backed up in their house on a windy day. A perfect solution for wind-driven downdrafts is a vacuum stack cap or a wind beater cap. Caps, these caps are not going to substitute a poorly uh, constructed chimney, but what they will do is on a windy day, uh, they will deter and create an updraft by the design that you see here. Now there are different applications for these, these caps, and we're going to go over each application. You're, you, you see a summary with this product, with the video, and you will see the different adapters you need in order to do your project. So Dean is going to touch on the different applications first. What are the different applications, Dean? Well, the first one is going to be a masonry chimney, your standard uh, masonry built chimney. Um, you're either going to have uh, one of three flue sizes. You're either going to have an 8x12 flue size, you're going to have a 12x12 12 flue size, or you're going to have a 12x16 flue size. Those are rectangular and square sizes. Obviously, this comes round, so you're going to need an adapter for that. Uh, we'll talk about the adapters in a little bit. Uh, the second application you're going to have is for a Class A chimney or a solid pack insulation chimney for like a wood stove, a freestanding wood stove. Um, obviously, you don't need any adapter that you measure the diameter and this is going to slide right down inside of the uh, factory built Class A chimney system. The uh, third application you're going to have is for a air cooled or an air insulated prefabricated chimney where you have the double or the triple wall piping that you still need to allow for that air to get down in there to cool the chimney properly so there's also an adapter that uh, would be for air cooled insulated air insulated chimneys. Um, the, first, uh, the first adapter let's talk about are the, uh, the masonry adapters. Okay, the first type of application we're going to talk about is a masonry chimney. Uh, that's your typical uh, chimney that we deal with, uh, that you're going to deal with. Um, we're going to have two different types of adapters that go to a masonry chimney. First, we're going to talk about your masonry uh, installation, masonry application. Um, you're going to basically run into three different size flues, which are standard for uh, wood burning fireplaces. Uh, your first size is, is going to be an 8x12, your second size is going to be 12x12 12 12 square, and your third size is going to be a 12x16 rectangular. So you need to measure the uh, size of the flue that you have to determine which adapter you need for the wind beater cap. Here we're looking at a rectangle, rectangle flue. This could either be an 8x12 clay flue or this could be a 12 by 16 flue. If this is an 8 by 12 flue, you're going to use the small rectangle adapter, part number 14924. The uh, masonry adapter will fit right onto that flue, and then the round, it'll have a round hole that the uh, wind beater cap will attach right to that. If you have a 13 by 13 square, you're going to use a large rectangle adapter, part number 14928. And again, that rectangle adapter is going to fit onto the flue, and then the, it'll have a round uh, connector to it, and the wind beater cap will connect right to that. Uh, going back to if you have a 12 by 16 flue, you're going to use the large rectangle adapter for the 12 by 16 rectangle flue. And again, it'll have a, a round adapter that the uh, wind beater cap will connect right to. So that's basically your first type of insulation would be to a masonry chimney. Uh, the second type of insulation you're going to run into would be a solid pack chimney or a class A chimney. This would be for uh, applications such as like a freestanding wood stove. Uh, you're going to be you're going to have a stainless steel pipe. It's going to be a double wall with insulation packed in between the two walls. Uh, basically, all you need to do is measure this inside, innermost diameter of this pipe. It, typically, it's going to be a 6, 8, 10. Uh, and then that's, that's what you want. You don't need any adapter. You don't need any kind of special adapters for this. 
the wind gear cap will actually slip right down inside of this uh, Class A chimney system. Uh, the third application that you're going to run into would be your air-cooled or uh, manufactured, prefabricated uh, fireplace chimney system. Um, typically it's going to be a double wall or a triple wall system. Um, you want to measure the inner diameter. Typically that's going to be 8 inch diameter. Sometimes you'll run into a 10. And then the adapter will, will actually come with this. And the adapter is designed so that it fits over and covers the outermost pipe to keep rain from getting down in there. But it also allows the air to get down inside to cool the pipes the way it's supposed to be designed. So you don't want to you don't want to seal off these outer pipes. You want to have that adapter so that you're still getting the air down inside to cool the chimney to insulate it. And that's basically the three different types of uh, applications that you'll run into.